Okay, so right now we are uh, six below zero, regular temperature, and with the wind chill factor, it says we're 12 degrees below zero. So I can tell you, it's really cold. I mean, really cold. Like my eyes keep freezing. So, um, so what we're gonna do? It's gonna get colder. Um, it's a lot colder right now. It is 4:30 p.m. and we got quite a bit of snow. Hey doggies, I'm feeding all the animals now, and Larry's getting the uh, the livestock trailer so we can make another windbreak because they said that a really big uh, storm, a wind storm's coming this way. I mean, we're already having big gusts. There's even snow inside the goat barn. I don't even know how it got in there, other than under the rafters. But uh, all right. I know, I know. Okay, Alright. I'm running, sorry. Oh, there goes the gate. Yeah, it's really windy. Yeah, you see? Yeah, I saw it. Put the skate here. Yeah. Oops, sorry about that. I gotta try to open the gate. My fingers are not working. <laughs> Okay, got it. Here we go. I don't know who we are. We're all bundled up. Come on, let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on, guys. Food. Come on. Look, we got a bunch of food here. Look. Yeah. Sorry, you don't recognize me. Come on, Sue Ellen. Here. It's okay. You, you smell me? You know who I am? Come. Let's eat. Come on, guys. Over here. Come on. All right. There we go. Let's eat up. Go ahead. It's okay. I'm downwind of them so they, they can't smell me. It's coming in my face. Oh, there you go. Problem with uh, diesel equipment is it doesn't start very well in really cold weather, and all of these are diesel, <laughs> so I don't know if it's going to start. He's trying to start it. Yeah, 
it ain't gonna start, I don't think. And the batteries die. Mm-mm, ain't gonna move. You can hear this wind, but it's really loud. It goes. Whew. It's Okay, well, we were able to get a bale of hay from the other side of the property. We try to get it over here to the cow so they can eat during the night. Uh, all of my eggs in the chicken barn, I went in there to get the eggs and they're frozen solid. It's crazy, I dropped one on the ground and um, it just is solid and so, that's a first. <clears throat> so they're not gonna move out of the way.
Good morning. Welcome to Viking Mountain Ranch. Well, I tell you what, that was some storm last night and it's uh, really cold. Right now, it's uh, 8 below zero and with the wind chill, they say 23 below zero. It's better than last night though. Uh, everything's frozen, so what I did is, uh, and the faucet's not working. We had no casualties. It's a miracle because it was freezing cold. I'm so impressed. Let me tell you, uh, animals are so much stronger than humans. Humans are so weak. Uh, it's crazy. I think it's because the mindset of humans is what limits, you know, the thinking. You know, people that would be stuck out here would say, oh, I can't do this, I can't do this. There must be a way out of this. And, you know, and with that mindset of doubt, I think that they, they limit themselves. You know, the animals, on the other hand, there, they know there's no option. They have to endure it, and and they do. You know, they just they just do it. They don't give up. They just keep fighting, and that's really impressive. I'm telling you, the turkeys are doing fine. Everybody's shivering and shaking, but I heated some water in the house, and I poured it on top of their ice bucket there, and now they're all drinking. You can see they're just uh, shivering. Sorry guys, I did not create this. <laughs> it is cold. Larry, he's over here with the crowbar. Um, he's trying to break the ice up for the cows. I'm gonna go head over here for Newton and Inky. The ducks are fine. Um, I don't think they're gonna have any any swimming today though I, can't. <laughs> I think it's frozen all the way solid it's not <sighs> nope it is frozen solid so I'm gonna have to pour some boiling water on top of that milk the goats yet because uh, it's too too early the Sun is coming out hey babies look at that I don't know if you can see this I poured some hot water on there it's steaming hey chai chai doing all right girl rough night huh the little chickens were in here cuddled up with the goats you okay Tiamat she's just shivering I'm sorry Not fun. Your coconut. Good morning, sweetie. Pour some water. You got some liquid water. Drink it before it freezes. All right, let's get check on the boys now. I've already fed everybody, so they're eating and they have water. Come on, Newton, Inky. I'm gonna have some water for you. Okay. He's drinking water. I mean, look at him. This is an alpine goat from the Alps, and he's shivering like crazy. Okay. More water, boy. Here. Okay. All right. There's more water. Okay. No. Dogs. Good morning, welcome to Viking Mountain Ranch. Well, we're on day three and all the pipes are frozen, so we have no water. And uh, so it's it's been a, a struggle <laughs> uh, trying to heat water in a kettle on the stove and make it boil and then pour it on top of the, what we have is frozen. All the pipes are frozen. 
everything is just frozen completely solid um, and the thing about it is it's only three degrees so what happens is when you pour water on top of this for a few minutes it uh, it's liquid but then it freezes right away so trying to get the animals to hurry up and uh, drink is a challenge because uh, you know they don't understand hurry so in the barn here try to I have a, this cattle because we have to ration water we only have 15 gallons of water saved up inside the house so I'm putting little bowls of water like this on top of their frozen ice trying to get them to, uh, to drink E.T. Mont here sweetie pie let me pour some of this frozen there you go I'm drink or yep I want to drink and the chickens the little chickens are in here Good girl but yeah, their water bowls are uh, nothing but a gigantic ice cube. So everybody uh, is eating. I'm giving them hay this morning. Okay, let's go. Let's go see what we can do about the turkeys. turkeys the rice is frozen the water is frozen <laughs> can't it's so crazy because I, I hate gloves. I hate working with gloves and I never wear them, but now I have to wear them. So fingers will freeze off. All right, guys, let's go. Come on out, everybody. Woo. See if we can get you some water here. Here. There you go. Drink up fast. I don't think I have the food. Let me go get your food. Let's get the chickens fed. All right, good morning, guys. Good morning. Everybody's up on the roost. See if we can get this door open for them. Maybe they'll go out today. Go on out. Nobody wants to go out. I gotta go get some boiling water. I ran out <clears throat> to the turkeys, and this is their water. Someone pooped in it. All the places. <laughs> All right, let's go see if I can get you some water because chickens must be able to have water to process their food. For right now, I'll get some water for you. <clears throat> Ducks were quite happy. They've been sleeping under my, my vehicle where there's no snow, and that keeps their feet from getting frostbitten. So they're eating up a storm. Poured some boiling water over their ice block. They got water. Sorry, guys, I didn't mean to. Startle, you go back. Eat.
here's the cows and they're finally drinking some water Hopefully, you break up the ice so uh, it's like the top part's frozen, but not much in there is there, guys. You gotta go get some boiling water out of the house. It's basically just ice pieces. A little bit in the bottom there. Two and ice, huh? So what we have to do is... Uh, go down to where the well is and take a, a heat lamp and try to thaw out the pipes because the the head is uh, frozen solid so no water to the house no water anywhere on the ground <laughs> alright guys let's go get that going let's go work on that Okay, we're down at the well again. <laughs> we haven't had water now. Today is the fourth day. So, here's the pipe Larry just cut off. You can see that it's got ice in it. It's got an ice cube, but it busted. So this whole thing's got to come apart. And here's the other part of it. Filled with ice. So, that's... But we can't get it to thaw out because it's only, I think, what, 20 right now? 20, 20 degrees, yeah. so it's frozen. So the dilemma is, today is Christmas Day. Everybody's closed, no matter how far we drive. We're not going to find any parts that we need for the well. Um, the pipes are busted completely. There's no place to get any water. Um, so, and the water that we did have in the troughs, it's frozen solid. So, all we have is ice. And the poor animals, I mean, the cows are over here crunching ice. And the goats are, they're just, they, they won't crunch the ice, they're just not drinking. The chickens aren't drinking, turkeys aren't drinking, dogs aren't drinking. And the, the boy goats on the other side, everybody's got ice. So, I figure, best way to do that... I mean, when you melt snow, there's not much water in it because it's pretty dry. So I'm just going to collect all the ice and get the metal containers. And I put a couple of pieces of uh, wood, but I don't want to spare our firewood either because we need that for the house. Put some in here. I'm going to get the ice, put it in the metal containers and try to melt it because everybody needs water. And today is day four. So, um, actually yesterday, Christmas Eve, we drove four hours to get some parts and we need an inch and a quarter but we ended up getting an inch because there's a lot of uh, a lot of PVC that goes from the well um, to the pressure tank and all that kind of stuff and so uh, we just didn't get every single part that we needed because there was more busted parts than we actually knew so today when we started taking everything apart we found oh wow there's more busted pieces so that's how it is. So, got to do what we can. Poor animals are thirsty. Here's the dogs. <laughs> hey, no worries. Water's coming. So, uh, they have turned over their all of their water buckets, and there's ice. Their ice big old ice cubes laying out there. I'm going to melt those up. They'll have water. Well, as with life, it's just another hurdle to jump over. Just another obstacle course. It's never easy. <laughs> so, all right, well, let's go do what we got to do and get it done. Animals need water, okay? Thanks for watching Viking Mountain Ranch, and come along for the next adventure.